My robot calls you scallywag. I call you a punk ass bitch. Seven, seven. Ah, you whore. I, uh, I'm not too sure where we are, Kodzi. It's been a little while. Battle Tested Peace Productions, my name is Ibaka. We are getting back into Fallout 4. Man, it's been a minute. Uh, what did I just do? What was the last thing I did? Uh, recap. <laughs> You'll die, Skinny. You'll die right here. Okay, I just remembered. We finished up uh, Nick Valentine. And I'm supposed to meet him back at his at his office. If I can find out or remember where his office is, that would make this a lot quicker. Explore the combat zone, sure, bro, sure. But first, let's talk to Nick. Are you here, Nick? Oh God. It's really you. Well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday, death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. You owe me money. Hey, happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre-war ruins all the time then, do you? Well, yeah. actually. Every cap we agreed to for finding him. Plus a little something extra, you know. Oh, that's mighty fine if you're of you. Looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat. Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa, one case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. Uh, yeah, in a minute. Uh, hey, Mister. I done got way too heavy, Cobsy. I need you to take some of this nonsense. Uh, yeah, you can have that. Faded trench coat, trench coat, formal, formal hat. Uh, I don't want the tuxedo right now. Worn fedora. I don't want the cage army either. Gonna be naked for a second. Um, but I have two sunglasses. I want to dress like Nick for a little while. Let me see. Faded trench coat, sunglasses, formal hat. Okay. There we go. Now I'm dressed just like Nick. All right, let's see what we got. When you're trying to find someone gone missing the devil is in the details right right tell me everything you can no matter how painful it might be yeah bro i don't normally talk to the police you know what i'm saying because y'all be on some fuck shit but uh they took my uh my wife about they took her i mean they shot her in the face and, and then they took my kid what, what do you know about that my wife was murdered she was trying to keep them from taking sean and they they just it's okay you don't need to say anything more so we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers but they waited until something went wrong to resort to violence right what else can you tell me uh you know what i'm saying they were some whole ass niggas, you know what i'm saying they looked like hoes you know what i'm saying when you think about a hoe that's what they was you feel me they, they, you know who takes a baby who who the hell steals a baby we're looking for my son sean he's less than a year old why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. You think so? Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the gunners, and of course there's the Institute. Uh, let's talk about the institute. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Oh. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, where they are not even me 
And I'm a synth myself. You don't say. It's got a prototype anyway. Yeah, uh, let me see. I don't want to be rude. I mean, clearly you're a prototype. You're missing parts, and that bothers me, but I don't want you to know that. Uh, don't know anything. Fine. Let's find Either Sean. Way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? Uh, one of them was bald like me. He's the he's the fucking guy I was telling you about. He was bald, and then there was a lady like in this full body cast suit. Not a body cast. What you call that? A jumpsuit? Radiation jumpsuit? You know what I'm saying? The woman was dressed in, um, I think it was a kind of hazard suit. Hazard suit. The man had some sort of metal brace on his arm. Maybe some kind of improvised armor? A lot of hired guns do that to look tough. Why ain't she writing this down? Hazard suit is interesting. Not many mercs can afford something that fancy. What else do you remember about them? Bald and scarred. One of them came right up to me. Bald head, scar across his left eye. Wait, it couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? No, nah, man, but they make delicious cereal. You know what I'm saying? Uh, is he in the cereal business? Do you know? Who is he? Do you think he has Sean? Hmm. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but... No one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? He did. He had a kid with him, didn't he? He yeah, did? that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. Oh, well, well that has to be my son. It's Sean. It has to be. Somehow. Don't jump the gun on me. You said you were looking for an infant, remember? That's over nine years difference by my count. I was Look, frozen. Maybe he has a son of his own. Maybe it's someone else's kid. Either way, they both vanished a while back. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. No, you're not. I, li I, I actually just rescued you. You're not always careful. That's a lie. That part of town is a damn stadium. What is there to be afraid of? Everything is out in the open. All right, Nick, lead the way. Go ahead. Take point. Walk a little faster. I didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance? Bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional. Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies. Oh, whoops. Because they're all dead. Except you. Nine to one odds says he's our man more than just you identifying his distinguishing features the mo is all him as well leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later not many mercs in the commonwealth can pull that off you good yeah bro you're right uh this is no way to you know brand cereal if you if you want to merchandise cereal you know what i'm saying this is not how you do it you don't steal the kids you just run some commercials you know poor poorly conducted ads to get the kids attention you know you don't got to steal them I think he asked for a light I hope he did one heck of a lock got something to hide Kellogg yeah you give it a try a master lock I'm not gonna be able to pick this bro don't think I can pick this yeah no hey Valentine we can't get through that door no luck we need to find the key Okay. See that platform in the distance near the city entrance? No. That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Oh. Why don't you go ask around there? I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. Yeah, bro, you might be here for a minute. Uh, I'm known to uh, be gone for months and months at a time, so you just work, focus on that lock. I, I might, I might skedaddle. I don't know yet. You know, bro, we'll get back to Nick in a little while. Uh, there were some robots i was supposed to go and talk to you know what i'm saying i'm, I'm gonna go and see them oh madness where'd you go there you are okay i like nick valentine a lot i really appreciate uh you know old timey detective type people i think they're fun and, and you and you know that might be what fascinates me with batman the animated series you know just that old timey 1930s or 50s 
vibe. I don't think the animated series knew where the hell they were. Either it was the 30s or the 50s or the 60s. I, I don't know. Uh, the technology says it was like at least the 2000s, but the vernacular in that show has got to be the 19, you know, 50s at, at the least, at the latest, I'll say. Tatsy, are you taking notes? Ain't nobody taking notes today, bro. There it is, Grey Garden. I remember this a little bit. Let's go see what they need help with. Hmm. But first, a quick change of clothing. Okay, let's ask around here. What up, bro? Nope, he doesn't talk much. Hello? At Grey Garden, the price is always right. Shall okay. We make a deal? I mean, yeah, but that depends on you, you know what I'm saying? You sound like a game show host. That's the correct answer. Well done. Ladies and gentlemen, should we tell the lucky contestant what fabulous prize he's won? Cash. I'm on cash. Uh, sure. Okay. Right this way, please. Let's take a look at your fabulous prize. Is it mutt fruit? Because I'll take mutt fruit, too. Mutt fruit is delicious. Where's the prize? You lied. It's a brand new car. Oh, that's hilarious. Now, if you've already got the latest in sleek, stylish, atomic-powered automation, uh -huh. you can also take your winnings in the form of a cash prize. How does 100 caps sound? <laughs> I've got an idea. Let's make a deal. I like it. How about 150 caps? Oh, Cosworth didn't like that. You a hoe. Take the I'll caps. Take the cash prize. Here you go. And if you want to use your winnings to make a few purchases from Robco, we certainly won't complain. <laughs> well, it's been a real pleasure. Thanks for playing. Never, never in my life have I done that before. Okay. There's someone I'm supposed to talk to. Y'all need to help with something, bro. Don't waste my time. What's what's happening? What's up? Welcome to Grey Garden, darling. Oh. This is the Commonwealth's first and only hydroponics facility. A lady. Entirely That's pretty ingenious. I bet you can work around the clock. Not only that, but your data collection and analysis must be top notch. I'm sure these crops want for nothing. Indeed. Of course not. Our unique hierarchy allows for constant operation. You see, there are two kinds of robots here. The worker drones carry out labor and maintenance. We supervisors, that is myself, green and brown, possess sophisticated cognition processes. We are capable of complex analysis and decision making, a testament to the genius of our creator. I see. And did Dr. Gray design you to be a pleasure model? Yes. <laughs> don't, don't worry about that. We'll, we'll come back to it. What became of Dr. Gray? Like so many others, he died in the war. Oh. It was a terrible loss. Robotics and artificial intelligence were our creator's great passions, mm. rivaled only by his love of television. Perhaps you've noticed that I possess a rather singular personality. As do the other supervisors. Mm-hmm. You know, speaking of great passions and love, perhaps me and you could I can effortlessly guide you through the intricacies of con Okay, I'll let's get back to the game. I well, it's definitely unique. Sort of hard to miss. I'll Voice is doing it for me. As a compliment, darling. Definitely a compliment. After all, the last thing any woman wants to be is Feeling that voice. If it's caps you require, Brown might have a few or jobs. Ah, uh, there's one other thing. A question, really. Tell me, darling. What do you think of the water around here? I'm more interested in your water personally, but the water here is is uh pr pretty bad. It's awful. <laughs> Isn't it though? Pressure is down, radiation is up. Why, it's practically toxic. Damn it, Cosworth. Just think what it must be doing to my skin. This will never do. I don't mean to impose, darling, but perhaps you could lend us a hand. 
I mean, I could lend you both hands if 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 you need. I don't make a juicy you know, place. Right? <laughs> Sorry. Marley, yes. Be... All right. Marvelous. Simply marvelous. Most of our water comes from the old Western plant south of here. Uh huh. Such an eyesore. Be a dear and pay a visit. Hmm? See what you can do. Maybe tidy up the place. It must be filthy. If you can get it working again, I'm sure I can come up with something for you. I like the sound of that. And perhaps I can come up with something for you as well. Mm. Okay. From what I can remember... Oh, wait. Yeah, this place is uh, full of super mutants. You know, I don't think it would be wise to go down there and start a fight. But uh, that's exactly what we're going to do, Cosworth. It's been too much talking, not enough action. Let's get down there and blow some shit up. Starting to get a little bored. You know? And if you didn't know, I'm playing this. I'm playing Fallout 4, rather. Tally-ho, indeed. indeed. I'm playing Fallout 4 on the uh, PlayStation 4 with no mods. For some people that is really boring and i'm included in that it's kind of hard to get through this game playing it back bro there's a lot of dialogue you know what i'm saying there's a lot <laughs> of just dragging a little bit what is this stuff i need a fusion core i'm guessing there's one down there with the super mutants you know what i'm saying it, it's tough to get through i try to make it a little fun with witty wordplay and plenty of what they call uh bullshitting but you know that only goes so far so i'll do my best here man what's this bobby pin i don't want no dress what i'm gonna do with a dress bro what else you got run that run all that okay let me see i don't want to get too off track when i get a quest going i like to try and finish it up yeah bro you might be here for a minute uh i'm known to uh be gone for months and months at a time so you just work, focus on that lock. I, I might, I might skedaddle. I don't know yet. <laughs> That's all right. And it's all right to finish quest. You know, it could take a while. That's okay. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. There we go. Look at that, Cletus. Let me in here. I just realized I need a fusion core. I don't really want to go back. Oh, look at that. Oh, hell yeah. Look at that. I don't want to go back to Sanctuary right now, bro. I kind of just want to, you know what I'm saying, be out. Oh, a beer. Wonderful. All right, Kazi, I'm going to take a nap. You know what I'm saying? From the looks of it, this was already owned by the, uh, what are we right now? The Minutemen, so this, this is all mine anyway. I'm the new general. Damn it, Cosworth. Out there fighting dogs. What I tell you? What did I tell you? Thank you for doing your job. You're amazing, Cosworth. That is exactly what you're supposed to do. Defend me. Where you at? Cosworth can actually die in this uh, profile because I have the robotics thing up. Oh, man. What did you kill? I want to eat it. Maybe. What was it? Was it a dog? I don't see any bodies. Damn it, Cosworth. When you secure the kill, take the meat. We got to survive out here, bruh. Oh, there it is. Good job, Kazi. Hell yeah. All right. Let us get into combat formation. <coughs> Excuse me. Damn it, Fusion Core. Hold steady. Oh, goody. Another one. <laughs> All right. There go some of them lames right there, bro. Got baby hawks. Baby hulk. <coughs> Excuse me. Baby hulks walking everywhere. Let's uh, get it going. Shot him right in the ass. Probably didn't even feel it. He felt that, though. <laughs> My robot calls you scallywag. I call you a punk ass bitch. Damn it. Who gave him a rocket launcher? Oh, I see you coming. Cosworth, you dumbass. Why would you walk into him? No, you don't. 
Watch out for them rocket launchers. Come on. Come to me. I like this. <laughs> uh, let me see. I got a shotgun. What up, bro? How you doing? Good to see you. What you got? Run that. Cosworth, feel free to fight back. It's okay. It's just more food. You know what I'm saying? What's happening? I like this. I like this a lot. Uh, let me see. Gotta be smart about this. I didn't want any trouble when I came here. That's a lie. I want you all dead. Oh, damn it. I don't want a rocket launcher. Yeah, I'm cool on a rocket launcher. Kazi, I really wish you weren't dead right now. Damn, he's blowing me up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh, here we go. I'm all alone out here now. God! Oh, free bomb! Awesome. Somebody is cooking my shit. Where is he at? Is it you? You got a strong gun. Bro, this suit is almost toast. Man, you take forever to kill. I mean, unalive, sorry. I'm gonna unalive you. It's safer for the internet. Safer for YouTube. Safer for us all. Okay, nothing there. Cause if you you just hang tight, buddy. I don't. There you go. Yeah, he a weak one. Let me take him down easy. Die! Did I hit him? I did hit him. Why are you not taking damage anymore? There we go. I didn't hit him. <laughs> one more should do you. <laughs> That's good stuff, Kazi. You missing out on all the action, man. What do I want to eat? Give me that mac and cheese. That Brahmin meat ain't cooked. Don't eat uncooked Brahmin meat. Nah, give me that corn, that cram. Crispy squirrel bits, you know what I'm saying? Dirty water. I like that. I like that a lot. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. I know, you know I can see you. Damn it. Hmm. There you go. Shot him right in the forehead. <laughs> All right, Kazi, I'll see you later. I hear something moving. What is that? Where's my fusion core? My fusion core is low, bro. Run it. Run it. Okay. I know the super mutants are outside. I think the only thing inside are uh, Mirelarks. God damn it, Codsworth. Ugh. <laughs> I should really run home and get a fusion core. But do I really want to do that? Watch out for these traps. Why can't I unarm? Un oh, man. I can't unarm that. Codsworth, watch your step. Or you could be next, man. Help defend Sunshine Tidings Co. Uh, why not? What's happening, bro? It's good to see you, you know what I'm saying? I came all this way to make somebody a pack look like it's you. Was that it? Was he the only one y'all couldn't defend yourselves from? Ugh. I feel like he was the only one. And I really hope he wasn't. Rocket launcher? Dickless! <laughs> oh, that's great. Hmm. Oh, there's a legend. I'll deal with the legend. I don't fight him. Right, Nass. Go on and transform. I know you want to. Go on and mutate. Oh, damn. <laughs> I guess not. Was that everybody? Man, y'all suck. Y'all couldn't have did that? Hey there. Hey, I just wanted to introduce myself. We heard people talking about your radio beacon, so we figured we'd give it a try. I'm hoping if we put our minds to it, we can help turn this place around. Uh huh. Anything specific you want me to do, I'm willing to pitch in anywhere you need. Uh, no. Not right now. Thanks. All right. Just let me know. Why are people still coming here, dude? There's barely anything here. Turn the damn beacon off. Turn it off.
Okay, Kazi, we are finally back. Let's get back to taking care of the uh, Grey Garden business here. I am confident there is just all sorts of loot. I am just walking past. Ugh. Fuck. <laughs> all right, let's get inside. Like I said, I'm pretty sure it's just Mirelarks inside, bro. So hopefully this don't take too long. Why do they collect skeletons? Sick shit. Oh wait, my bad. They eat people. They're can they're not even cannibals, I guess. I are super mutants still humans? I wouldn't know. It's not really my business either. All right, Kazu, we going in. Look at cold the hell yeah. All right, bro. I ain't got that much time, so. <clears throat> No such time to waste, rather. So whatever y'all got going on up in here. You know, it's always something terrible. Let's see what's going on. Hmm. Hmm. Awesome. Got a new location on the map. What's that? Run it. Yes, indeed. I'm going to try not to take too much junk while I uh, am recording. I'll always come back and clean places up, though. I need to start building my settlements. You know? It takes time. No, it doesn't. It doesn't take that much time. But I still don't want to do it. I just kind of want to shoot stuff, you know? I just want to shoot things. Until they are no longer alive. In this video game. In this video game alone. Nice. What's that? Can I take that? Can I take anything? Duct tape. Is that a scalpel? Yep. I just said I wasn't going to collect junk, and here I am. Okay. That's what this game does. These games, bro. Skyrim and Fallout. You just want to collect all the junk. Okay, what I need is an outside, it's downstairs. I remember this. Let's go, Kazi. Or not. Kick it. Damn, I need some shotgun shells. Institute pistol. Why is this gun so egregiously large? I don't even want to use it. I have to sell that. Hmm. What? What? Why? Die! Okay. Let's see. What's in here? Novice, wonderful. I really enjoy the lock picking in these games, man. Something satisfying about it when you finally get that lock to picking. That's it. Hmm. Oh hell yeah! What's up? Run all that. Yes. What else going on in here? Where the stem packs at? Hmm. Okay. Like I said, there. Are are a bunch of Meyer Larks in here that I'm gonna have to deal with. Cause if you down here, bro, you just gonna be gone. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what to tell you. Damn it. Come on. Yes. What's that? Pipe weapons can be strong, but they, I just don't like the way they look. They're not pleasing to the eye, you know? Shut the turret off. What is this? No, go back to the turret. Deactivate. Thank you. What's that? Excellent. You are now able to build patio furniture at settlement workshops? Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh man, I don't know where this cough is coming from, brother. It's dastardly. Still shooting this thing. Oh, I can't destroy it if it's not attacking me. That sucks. Is that new? I feel like that shouldn't be a thing. Okay. I smell a fusion core. I smell it. Where is it? I hear it. Damn it, I need more fusion cores. The button isn't functioning. Okay. So, is there a perhaps another way to get through here? Hmm. Try this way. What that is? Drain. Making some progress. Look at that. The water is going down. And there's plenty of food in here. Like you. Your food. Make some crab cakes out this bitch. Where your homies at? I'm eating all of y'all. 
All of y'all are dinner. Come here, don't run now. You know I'm hungry. Come on. Eating good tonight, baby. Where's my pistol at? Let's go. What's happening? What's happening? Ah! You whore! <laughs> run that. What's this? Can I open it? Awesome. Hmm. I really gotta start paying more attention <laughs> to my health, excuse me. <laughs> oh, what's that? Body pan. Yeah, what else you got? Aluminum, hell yeah. Always take the aluminum. Okay. And that led me back here. Hmm. There's more to be done here. Where are you, delicious Mirelarks? I'm going to eat you and your children. That sounds creepier than it actually is, but you are technically fish. Okay, yeah, no. Power armor and water does not work. I need to lower the water some more. Let me figure out how to do that. Where the hell is Cosworth? I know for a fact he isn't dead because we haven't fought anything. He's upstairs hiding. Punk ass robot. Okay, I want to go in here first. What's this? Another lockpick. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Got it. Okay. I need a fusion core. I heard one. I know for a fact there's a fusion core in here, but where is it? Oh, look at that. Take that too. Okay, in here. Anything of use? Not really. Wonderful. Here we go. What up, bro? How you doing? Good to see you. What's happening? <laughs> ah! Blast you! Okay, we good? Ah, close it. Mm. <laughs> Come on to me! Come on! Okay, I gotta get over there now. I can't jump that. I need a jetpack on this thing, bro. Pretty sure you can get a jetpack on this. Hmm. It's gonna be a lot of Meyer Larks. I hear your little feet clamping. Come on. Damn it. You know, there's a theory. A SpongeBob dark theory that Mr. Krabs makes Krabby Patties out of other crabs. And now we know why. Because you're fucking delicious! Die! Die! <laughs> awesome. Alright, Kazi, I'm glad you're uh, awake again. Got work to do, you know what I'm saying? You've been slacking. I've been down here getting all the food by myself. What's wrong with you, Kazi? Okay. I'm pretty sure there's like a really tough Mirelark that's gonna pop up somewhere. No? I can just eat this? Awesome. I think there's one more. Whoops. More progress. But how do I get in there? Mm. What? What is it? Stay where you are. <laughs> you stuck in a glitch. <laughs> Die slowly. <laughs> you still bleed, even when I don't hit you. Look at that. You're dead. Ah! Blast you! You must be the mama crab. <laughs> I'm going to eat you and your young. Handle that, Kazi. Hmm. That's right. Okay, my health is good. I don't want to go in the water with this uh, power armor, so I won't move really, really slowly. Let me see. There has to be a way around there. Damn it. I'm not. No, I got enough food. I'm not doing this. Uh, how do I get in there? Screw it. I'm going. Cosworth, you handle my light work. Hand handle it. What does this do? 
Nothing. Hmm. Let's see. Here we go. We start the main pump. Where's that? Oh, dude, there it is. Awesome. Those robots will have have better water now. That's important. Excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. Okay. No need to be rude. We're all just trying to survive here. Although I doubt you will. Delicious. Okay, let's get back to the hot robot lady. Oh, look at this. Gifts. Yep. Hmm. What the hell your problem, bro? What's wrong with you, bro? Hey, man. Back up. Personal space is important. Okay. Yeah, like I said, I'll come back here and clean house off camera later. What is that? Enhanced targeting card. Hell yeah, that can help me make turrets. All right. We're done here. Hey, how y'all doing? I'll cut y'all water back on. You know what I'm saying? The uh, hot robot lady said that she would suck my dick if I uh, did that. So hopefully we can work something out. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how she's going to make it happen, but we'll figure it out. Supervisor White. Darling, so good to see you. You fixed our water problem, didn't you? I did. I got a water problem myself. It's, it's, it's on the Lower East End. Yes, ma'am. Oh, such a gentleman, too. I simply must give you something. Yes, you must. Here, you can have some of our produce. I'll ask Greeny to give you a discount, too, if there's anything else you need. Now, I simply must get back to work. Ta-ta! You know, that's not what we call it where I'm from, but uh, hopefully it all works out the way I need it to. That's, that's fine. We could do with a spot of rain. Your, your wish has been granted. Battle Tested Beast Productions, my name is Ibaka. This has been <laughs> Fallout 4. Thank you so much for watching. I can't help but feel like there's something I forgot. I don't know what it could be. Again, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.